Hey everyone, it's Haley and welcome back to another video. Today I'm sharing a productive mom day in the life and to get started I'm going to be sharing a little bit of my morning routine. So the first thing that I do once we really wakes up and I'm ready to get into the shower, I go ahead and I get her some milk and sit her on the couch and turn on a show. Today she wanted to watch Mickey Mouse. So then I know she's occupied and will be getting into anything um, and I know that she's good while I'm in the shower, so I went ahead and showered, and I'm gonna go ahead and do my makeup and just get ready for the day. Waverly wanted to be by me and help out, so that's what you're gonna see. She's gonna be getting some lotion on and just being right here until we are ready to get ready for breakfast. But I'm going to just do a simple makeup routine and then I'll blow dry my hair. If it's blush, well, that's contour, and then we have to do blush. Blush. Uh huh. It's Good morning, you guys. I am just getting ready for the day currently. We are gonna go clean here in a little bit. So I'm just finishing my makeup. I'll get Waverly some breakfast. Yeah. Join me today for a productive mom day. I need to, like I said, work. I don't know if I'm gonna go to Walmart yet. I kind of need to, but I'm like, ooh, don't want to. So we'll see if we end up there. Um, I just need to like, vacuum the floors. Our house really isn't too dirty. Um, but my husband's changed his like work schedule a little bit where they're going in earlier but then they get home between like 6 and 6 30 so it has been a really nice him getting home this past week early um we've had dinner early we've just been able to get into more of a routine so like when one of us is giving Waverly a bath, the other is cleaning up dinner. And so I'm really excited just to kind of get things into more of a routine with that. It's going to be really nice and it's really good to have him home instead of him coming home like around 8 o'clock right when we're putting Waverly down and he'll just be there just for stories. So it's been really nice, but I'm going to go ahead and finish getting ready. I will have to blow dry my hair. Hopefully I have enough time. Um, lately I've been waving my hair and I've really been loving the way that that works. Like this week I waved it on Sunday and now it is Friday 
and I had my hair down until yesterday and I pulled it up into a pony and it still like was wavy so I think that's gonna be like my no new go-to so maybe during Waverly's nap I'll actually finish waving it when I have more time um just because I didn't get up early enough to be able to do that this morning but let's go ahead and finish me getting ready you ready to go Waverly yeah okay let's go back and up we go it is so bright I don't know why I had my foot on the brake I'm parked I was gonna get your sunglasses. Was it your sunglasses that fell? Oh yeah. There you go. So, I feel like whenever I end up filming these kind of videos, I never end up actually cleaning when I say that I'm going to go clean. So, we actually are not cleaning today which is totally fine with me um kind of just makes for a lazy day so it's currently like 10 45 so it's getting to be already in the afternoon <laughs> we usually don't like get out of bed until like nine me and we really we just love our sleep and i'm grateful that she lets me sleep as long as she does but we are just waiting in line to get a pop you have to let me know do you call it pop or soda um and then we will be headed on home to tackle the day and it's currently 40 degrees right now so i'm hoping maybe by the afternoon like when waverly maybe wakes up from her nap or maybe right before uh her nap or something usually it works better if we're going outside after her nap until it gets like really hot outside that we can go out all the time but hopefully maybe we can go for a walk today um trajan was maybe saying that he We'll get off early so then maybe we can if it actually is warm go to the park or something i know she's been dying to go to the park every time we pass any toys like from a park driving she's like oh, toys toys so she would love if we could go to the park so we'll see if we can make that happen today but we're gonna like go home kind of get the house tidy this morning play get all the things done that we need to but can you say hi waverly are you getting sleepy already can you say hi <laughs> okay so i'm gonna go ahead and get my pop now hey what can i get you hi can i get a 32 ounce for the georgia line of course anything else nope that should be it 92 for you thanks thank you how's your morning been it's been pretty good. How's it been yours? Good. Pretty good. good so far. It's good. Is that? We'll get that right out. Thanks. What are you doing, Wavers? I want raisins. You want raisins? We'll have to wait till we get home. I don't think I have any raisins in the diaper bag, okay? Sound good? We'll make a little snack when we get home. Here's that. Thank you so much. Yeah, have a good one. You too. Where's your, did you put your eyebrow in here? Where's your eyebrow? It's right there. Right there. there it is. Yeah, right there. Got your phone. Is there anything else that you took out? I grabbed your glasses. You got everything? Oh, yeah. let's take off this seatbelt. I have my hot camera. Yeah. Your camera, look at me. Yeah, okay, come here. Okay, come here. Oh, perfect timing time to go pee. Shoes off. Shoes off. Ow, my finger. Time to go try to pee, huh? Yeah, you can if you're really good. And pee. Your snack. Do you want raisins, apples with peanut butter, or granola bar? So while I cut up this apple, I wanted to talk to you guys about, I don't think I've talked about her little potty watch she has, and you might have noticed it in some of my videos, where she's wearing long sleeves, you don't notice it as much, but that has been one of the best things we've gotten for her, but she goes through spurts of like not doing well and then doing better, but the watch, you can set it for like multiple different like times, so shoot, there's like a 15, a 30, a 45, and you want to try one for now? 
a, like a hour and then it goes into like 90 minutes stuff like that so um she currently has it at the 30 minutes and if she continues to like get accidents at the 30 minutes i will bring it down to 15 and this last week was the first week we've really have been able to get away with her not wearing it and her going to the bathroom with very minimal accidents and i feel like maybe we could have waited a little bit longer to potty train but when she actually was getting the hang of it it was kind of something that we didn't want to completely just take it away um, and go back to diapers and kind of just lose all that progress because then it might really confuse her so this has worked really well for us but if you know somebody who's potty training or if you're a mom potty training too if they just are having a hard time remembering to go this is a great option and it's just honestly helping them get practice for trying to go to the bathroom so like there's some times that we like her timer will go off and we'll try to go and um she won't like actually go which is totally fine but it's getting her that practice to go and try to go um and then there's times that she does go and then there's times that she'll tell me before her timer even goes off like if she's had a lot of liquid so i just thought i would share if you want me to link the one that we have um i can it's just from amazon and it's really nice because it lasts quite a while and it takes a lot to turn off the timer because that was one thing I was worried about having it kind of be touchscreen, but it's like only just like a little dot that's touchscreen. I just got Waverly apples and peanut butter. I am just giving her half because it's like almost 11.30 and I want her to be able to eat dinner, not dinner, lunch in like an hour-ish. You wanna watch a show? Well, do you wanna help mommy tidy up first? And then we can play until lunch. I'm going to go ahead and kind of just like tidy the house up. Like I said, it really isn't too messy. We just have like the dishes from breakfast. I need to wipe the counters down. Um, and then I uh, need to just give the floors a quick vacuum. So nothing major. So let's go ahead and get all that done. So right now I'm just currently tidying up the kitchen. It really wasn't too messy. We just had a few dishes that needed to go into the dishwasher. I'm going to hand wash a few dishes and then really the kitchen is going to be good to go. I wasn't worrying about too much cleaning, just tidying up. And then I will start a load of laundry just to get that going. And then I'm also going to tidy up the living room, get that all cleaned. And then we'll vacuum all of the floors in the living room and the kitchen just to get those nice and tidied up. And then we'll go ahead and make some lunch.
so Waverly's still playing with her blocks, which I'm totally okay with. So we're just going to kind of vacuum around her toys right now just so that she can keep playing. What? Anyways, let's get to vacuuming. Now time to make some lunch. We are just going to be having leftovers today, keeping it really simple. And the day before, we had just had spaghetti and then vegetables. So I went ahead and just warmed up Waverly just some straight spaghetti noodles. I didn't put any of the marinara sauce on it just because it gets really messy. And where it was in the middle of the day still, I didn't want her to be dirty and have to take a bath in the middle of the day. So I just went ahead and just put some butter on the noodles and she ate it like that. And then we added some vegetables and then once she ate all of those I went ahead and gave her some pears because I always give her her fruit after or else she won't eat her food and then I'm going ahead and just warming up my spaghetti with the sauce and the vegetables and that is just our easy lunch that's leftovers we love a good leftover meal here and then a little bit after we'll probably put her down for now okay so i think i'm talking a little quiet so that way i don't pick her up i think i got waverly put down it is about 1 30 so we did good i am gonna go ahead and crimp my hair while she is napping but one thing has been very like hard i feel like as a mom having like kids go through different stages you go through so many different sleep patterns and you're always just kind of adjusting and figuring out what's best for them we've had a really hard time with just nap time and bedtime in general lately because if you guys have watched my videos you know that we have one of those like shoe racks on the back of our door which makes it so it's really hard for her to open it and she wouldn't open it all of the time but in the last like i don't know three weeks she's really figured out how to open up that door and because of it it makes it so when she is um trying to go to bed she will try for like five seconds and then know that she can get out so for the first little bit we would just have her be out for like five minutes and then we'd have her try to go to bed and then we would like kind of just repeat that until she would fall asleep but that would take so long her sleeping and for the most part she gets tired enough during her nap time um that she will just fall asleep perfectly fine for a nap but for bedtime that's when it gets to be a little bit more challenging and we're the type of people like if we're home we want to stick to like a pretty good schedule but we also are the type that we're okay if she is sleeping a little bit later for her nap because we know we're going to get home later and so then it um like she doesn't need to go to bed like at eight o'clock when she's supposed to all the time like we're okay with that we like to have that flexibility so we aren't just feeling like we're stuck at home um 
but I think with that then sometimes like if we're just frequently gone like there's been a little while where we wouldn't get home until like 10 o'clock even on like the weekdays so then it just kind of sets the routine and you have to kind of like put it back but I don't think that we'd ever like be so so strict because it just makes it so we can't actually like have fun and be able to do stuff especially in the summer when we're out doing a ton more outside so since Trajan's been getting home at a decent time this week because that's also another thing is it was so hard for Trajan would like and Waverly would only see each other for like 10-15 minutes and Waverly definitely like knew she wanted to see her dad more and like spend more time and so we found that the days that he would get home like then she really struggled with going to bed because she wanted to see her dad more so I think it's helping a lot that he's getting home sooner um but we just have been a lot more strict well, and I'm so proud of her because today I put her down at like, I don't know, it was like a little bit after 1.15 and she kind of was struggling to like want me to sing songs to her and I was like, no, we have to, like if you want me to sing songs, you have to show me you're ready and be trying to go to bed. So she finally was showing me she was ready and I'll just stand by the door with the monitor make sure she's not going to come by the door harder. But um she just went and she rolled around for a little bit and then she far right asleep so i am glad that she was able to do that because one day this week she did sleep on the floor she did not want me to go in there she just said she was going to sleep on the floor by the door and i was like okay she only took like a 40 minute nap but i was like you know that's better than nothing and at least she's sleeping in a room okay i got the hair all nice and beached wave and i loved that this just lasted me so long last time so hopefully this time it'll last again and i just like how it looks like i've done my hair every day but i literally don't even have to do anything to it i haven't touched it up or anything when i have to so that's really nice but let me know if you guys like the more kind of vloggy adding in more mom life things into my videos i really like kind of just chatting and talking i don't know i don't know if it makes it seem more realistic or what i always really try to be realistic with like my cleaning and everything that i'm doing um just because I know that it can be hard sometimes as a mom knowing how to manage it all. So let me know if you want to see more like mom life and what kind of mom life videos you'd want to see. I've been thinking once we kind of get our new evening routine down with Trajan's new work schedule, we might um, do an evening routine and then maybe a morning routine. I kind of shared bits and pieces today, but not tons but i think that's gonna wrap up today's video we really is just gonna continue napping and then trajan should be headed home in the next little bit he probably isn't gonna be working too late where it is friday but thank you guys all so much for being here and hanging out with me today if you enjoyed the video please give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more videos like these be sure you're subscribed and i will see you guys in my next one bye